So today we covered a few of Emil Durkheim's broad ideas. We covered sociology as a science, and we covered the concept of a social fact, and how by understanding social fact, which ultimately just means understanding how your society functions as a whole, sociologists can identify a problem within society and hopefully come up with a solution to uh, rectify that problem. One of the concepts we discussed in these videos is known to the term common consciousness or collective consciousness, which is exactly what it sounds like. It's simply defined as a shared set of beliefs or ideals within members of society. Now, it does beg a question. How could a way of thinking be external to an individual? Because that is ultimately what a shared belief is. And uh, it's pretty simple. Social facts actually reside externally. For instance, in one of the videos, we use Christmas as an example. Why do we give gifts on Christmas? It wasn't your idea to give one another gifts on that day. And the answer is, Christmas is, for lack of a better term, a social construct. One where everybody's perception of one another is deeply involved, right? And regardless of how little this family may or may not want to celebrate Christmas, at the end of the day, in the morning, there will still be gifts under that tree. And the reason is because if I don't want a gift at all, I still have no real way of knowing that the person across from me doesn't want a gift either. And that's ultimately what the whole family ends up concluding. So everybody ends up celebrating it regardless. And as far as my own personal experience goes, I could definitely resonate with the idea that there are times where as an, as an individual, as an individual, excuse me, we do not want to attend certain events or social obligations, but we attend it anyways, because just as previously stated, everyone's perception of one another is deeply involved. And that happens to be the case for society. If you really look at society from a bird's eye view, all it is is a game that involves everyone's perception of one another.